Then you're gonna do Kerrygold butter because it's the pure Irish butter and it's the best for you. You're gonna do organic heavy whipping cream without the carrageenan. If you look on the back, it does not say carrageenan. See that? No, it's good. And then you're gonna do the Trivia. Watch with Trivia because they like to blend with sugar and brown sugar for their baking blend, so just be careful on that. And then of course you're gonna use some type of blender. I, of course, prefer my Ninja. So, once the coffee is done brewing, you're going to pour it into the Ninja cup. There is a max liquid line. We're going to fill it up to that. And if it doesn't make it to that, that's okay. And next, I probably do about two or three tablespoons of the heavy whipping cream. Um, I'm almost on empty, so I'm just going to pour. And that's honestly about what I do until I get it like that nice light color. And it's all a personal preference on how you like your coffee. If you like cream with a side of coffee or if you like coffee with a side of cream is my absolute favorite part the butter mm, look at that pure butter can you believe that stuff mm, oh my gosh like what is a stick of butter like does anybody know what a stick of butter is i surely don't all right so i don't know if i can do this with my phone i usually do about two of these spoonfuls and then you just plop it on in there like so and it just floats and melts and looks amazing. I'm actually going to have to stop recording to, uh, well, maybe not. God, give me thumbs, right? Oh, just look at that, you guys. Look at it. Oh, okay. A tablespoon, and I do the Truvia. I was doing like a tablespoon and a half, but that was like way too much. And I was like jolting off the walls of my cubicle at work. So we took it back down to a tablespoon. And then you want to secure the lid on it. We're gonna power it on. And then we are gonna hit low. As y'all can see, I have a pretty big uh, coffee mug. Um, she's actually like really big. That's not your average size. People look at me like I'm crazy at work, but they just don't understand. And so all of that fits in there perfectly. And then I drink on it probably honestly sometimes till about 1 o'clock. It just depends on how busy I am and what the day is doing. So I will pour that in there. And then I have my butter coffee, keto coffee. Bulletproof coffee, fat bomb coffee, all ready to go for the rest of the day. So, before I do go, I just wanted to show y'all, like, the amazing frothiness that comes out of this coffee. Like, look at just how amazing that is. Like, I just can't believe it. It's amazing. So good.